Hey, you want to know what is the best productive morning habits or routines that you should adopt or develop so that every morning you wake up with more energy, more motivation and able to get more things done throughout the entire day? This is Sean from stunningmotivation.com and also the creator of Goal Setting Formula. And in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you one powerful rule that I learned from this book called The 5am Club written by none other than Sir Robin Sharma. So in this book, Sir Robin Sharma shared one powerful rule called the 20-20-20 rule that you can use to kickstart your morning so that every morning you wake up with more energy, feeling inspired, have more motivation, able to get more things done and of course, it also helps you to live a much more fulfilling life. Okay, As what the tagline of this uh, book suggests, own your morning, elevate your life. So what is this 20-20-20 rule all about? Let me explain in my computer. So you want to develop productive morning routines by using the 20-20-20 rule shared by Sir Robin Sharma in his book called The 5am Club. So what this rule is about is that you want to divide your morning routine into three pockets or three sections um, with 20 minutes each, the first 20 minutes, second 20 minutes, and the last 20 minutes. And during these sessions, you want to do something to elevate your mo morning routine so that you have more energy, more motivation, and able to get more things done throughout the entire day. Okay, so let us look at the first 20 minutes. So you want to spend your first 20 minutes into exercise and workout. Once you wake up in the morning, right, you want to make sure that you exercise, move your body and sweat a lot. Why? Because exercise releases endorphins, which is a kind of uh, hormone that is created inside your brain that makes you feel great. So you want to kickstart your morning feeling great. Do you know that people like Tim Cook, Richard Branson, Jack Dorsey, these are extremely successful people, right? They kickstart their morning with exercise. Just like Sir Robin Sharma says in his book, when you sweat more in training and you bleed less in war. So spend your first 20 minutes into exercise, regardless of whatever exercise you, you do. Okay, You can go for a run, you can run, you can swim, you can do a Tabata or you can do strength training. Whatever you do, make sure that you sweat a lot so that you feel good in the morning. Next, you want to invest the second 20 minutes into planning and reflection. For instance, you want to write down your goals, you want to review them, you want to practice your affirmations, you want to reflect on your life, you want to create a to-do list and plan your day so that you know what you need to do throughout the entire day. Okay? Why? Because clarity is power and planning actually gives you clarity. So this is why you want to plan your day in the morning. Okay? Imagine a day when you have no plan and you have no idea what to do. How will you go through that day? Probably you are going to wake up late and then you are going to spend, I believe, a lot of time on social media like you are going to check out Facebook, you are going to check out Instagram, probably you are also going to watch a lot of funny videos on YouTube, right? So you do not want that to happen. When that happens, you become reactive. You are reacting to things that are surrounding you, okay? Instead, you want to be proactive. And the only way you can be proactive is to know what you need to accomplish throughout the day. When you know what you need to accomplish, when you know what you want to do and you have a plan, only then you can follow through and take action according to that plan. And this is what I mean by clarity. So you want to spend the second 20 minutes into planning your day and doing some reflection. You can also practice meditation, right? So. Put in 20 minutes into writing down your to-do list, create your plan for the day, okay? In fact, that's what I've been doing for like the past 10 years already, okay? And I found that it has been very liberating and it gives me a clear direction of what I want throughout the entire day. And for the third 20 minutes or the last 20 minutes, you want to invest it into learning and improvement. This is where you want to read books, you want to listen to podcasts, you want to watch videos, okay? Not just any videos, all right? Useful videos, useful materials that 
help you grow yourself you see the only way that we can do much better in life improve ourselves uh, to become much more successful is through making changes correct and the only way to change is that if we improve ourselves because if you don't improve yourself there's no way that you can do better right so this is why you want to improve yourself and learn uh, in the morning okay when you read a book it inspire you it gives you new idea it makes you feel fresh right so this is why you want to um, make learning as part of your productive morning routines okay and I can tell you that morning is one of the best time to learn why because in the morning there's no one there to disturb you you can have you can have all the time for yourself um, from my personal experience I can tell you that I've been reading books in the morning for like years okay since years ago and I dare say that it is one of my most transformational habits that I've developed throughout the, my entire lifetime not throughout the years throughout my entire life okay so this is why you want to read okay without reading without learning you never improve so spend your last 20 minutes into learning so this is what the 20 20 20 rule is all about you want to invest the first 20 minutes into exercise and working out so that you feel great you kickstart your morning feeling great okay and you want to invest the second 20 minutes into planning and reflecting your life for instance you want to write down your goals you want to review them you want to create a to-do list and plan your day so that you know exactly where you are going and what you need to accomplish throughout the entire day okay and you want to invest the final or the last 20 minutes into learning and improvement this is where you want to read books you want to uh, listen to podcasts and you want to elevate yourself to a higher level of success all right and one more thing the 20 20 20 rule is not set in stone meaning you can customize it according to your own need you can have something like 10 10 10 rule or if you have much more time you can create something like 30 30 30 rule okay so that you will spend 30 minutes into exercise another 30 minutes into planning and another 30 minutes into reading and learning okay this rule is not set in stone customize it so that it fulfills your own personal need and if you want to learn more about um, building productive habits i suggest you to read this book from robin sharma the 5 a.m club i have left the link in the description box below so that make sure you check it out right I hope you get something out of this video and if you love this video make sure you like and subscribe to my channel and you can also let me know what you think about this video by leaving your comment below thank you so much